Hi, Jack and Devin here from Gumpler's product support team. Today we're going to show you how to use rust converter to restore iron or steel objects. But before we get into showing you how to use rust converter, it would probably be a good idea to know what it is. Yeah, rust converter is a synthetic polymer formula that converts existing rust into a black inert paintable surface. It then prevents further rusting of the object. Well, let's see how it works. It looks like we have a good uh, wheel to use here. We do. We have a wheel here that is pretty well covered in rust. But before we can apply the rust converter, we need to make sure we have the proper PPE on. To apply a rust converter, you should have protective gloves, eyewear, and proper ventilation. All right, now we've got our PPE on. What's the first step to applying rust converter? The first thing to do is remove any dirt, grit, loose rust flakes, or scale. You can do this by using a wire brush. You don't want to remove all rust, just what's loose. Then wipe the object clean before applying the product. And how will you be applying the rust converter? Today we'll be applying it with a paintbrush. Rust converter does also come in two other formulas, a sprayable for airless and compression sprayers, and an aerosol. To apply a rust converter, pour some into a small container. You don't need a lot because if you have extra, the used rust converter can't go back in the original container. Then just dip the brush into the rust converter and use your brush to apply, coating the areas with the rust. How many coats do you need to put on? The paint on version we're using today will require two coats. The other two formulas will require more. The spray on version requires three coats and the aerosol will actually require four. Looks like we've got the first coat pretty much on. Uh, about how long does it take to dry before we can apply the second coat? Drying time between coats will take about 20 to 60 minutes, depending on the conditions. Humidity and temperature will actually affect the drying time. Once it is dry enough for the second coat, it will change to a purplish hue, which you can see that it's actually starting to do now, letting you know that it actually is ready for a second coat. Once the two coats of rust converter have been applied, the rust converter does need to cure to turn the rust into an inert black form. How long does that typically take? That typically takes about 48 hours. After that, you can apply an oil-based paint. So overall, not too difficult or time-consuming process. For cleanup, rust converter is water-based. All you need is soap and water to clean your brush and container if you plan on reusing them. Yeah, make sure you dispose of any rust converter product you've poured out. Adding the used rust converter back into the original container will cause contamination. Well, thank you, Devin, for demonstrating rust converter for us. For even more frequently asked questions and information on rust converter, click on the link in this video. Thanks much.